What's up guys? Today is a different kind of day. I'm gonna be putting my hands on, on a brand new 2022 Western Star and Lore. Lore is the manufacturer of this car carrier. We're gonna see, we're gonna experience how it is and uh, we'll see how it goes. This is the, the bottom loader, easy loader, nine car. We're gonna go to the Bay Area today. I'm gonna be driving and Alex, his name is Alex as well, the owner of this truck. He's gonna be working, loading and loading. I'm gonna show him some place in the Bay Area that I go to usually. So stay tuned, it'll be exciting. This is Alex. Say hi. Ready to go? Ready to go, let's go. Let's go. You check out the stadium now, huh? So fancy. This is how it looks like being a driver's seat of a 2022 Western Star. She's got 6,492 miles on it. He just came from North Carolina. Whoa. You can definitely tell it's a... You can tell it's a Western Star. <laughs> no, it's good, it's good. I like it, man. It's automatic. It's a... It's a 13-speed automatic, yeah. It's okay. It's a little relaxed for me from the 18 speed. Automatic is good. It's good for the health. Just kidding. I can't wait, man. Let's go to the Bay Area. Let's check it out. We arrived at the first delivery, Stockton, California. You always have to set up your logbook. What did you do? On duty? Yep, On duty. delivery. Delivery. Let's go deliver this. Uh, what you got there? The Lexus? Yep. Uh oh. Somebody locked the door. It's your elbow. It's my elbow. <laughs> Alright, let's go see. Get it. Hello, sir. Hello. Let's get to work. This is his first trip. First car. First car. He only got loaded to North Carolina with help. Now he's gonna do all everything by himself. Turn on PTO? Yeah. PTO is on. We're gonna be delivering this Alexis. Hello. Good morning. Hey. How are you doing? I'm good. This your car? Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Well. We're gonna deliver right now. This is the main guy, Alex. No, you, you did? just try to do the ramps. Did you drop it? Around? No, I didn't touch. No, 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 Alex. Just pull the ramps, should be fine. Okay. It's, a, it's just a different setup. Okay. It's different than mine. All you gotta do is do this. So easy, man. there <laughs> it's very low she wants on that side I'm just doing nothing we're doing a garage door to door delivery garage to garage door to door I was gonna do delivery inspection just in case 
you gotta have pictures before you pick up and after you drop. So yeah, let's talk about this uh, setup that they came up with. You can drop this whole deck, you drop it all the way down, you can put a pickup truck on this one. This is insane. You can do two trucks, 1500 one on top of each other, and you're gonna be like 13, it's fine, 13, 6. So good. It's different than what I have, but no, that's that's the future, I guess. This is all the new stuff. This is just built like a month ago. We picked it up last week, two weeks ago. It's a big turn, man. Okay. Let's get out of this residential area. We're gonna go check in at the CarMax and we're gonna pull out the car. They usually just pretty easy, you just go inside, tell them the VIN number, they're gonna bring it out. We're gonna put it on number nine and let's go. How do you like it? I love it! Look professional. <laughs> Try to look professional. Put him in the middle. No, no. In the middle, always. I came back from the beta today and uh, Alex dropped me off at the brother's mother's shop so I can pick up my truck, they replaced the bushings but I can't express how pissed off I am check out my bumper you see something wrong? maybe bent yeah. basically what happened is I just texted the guy and I was like hey what happened to the bumper? 
And look at this. I was like, what happened to the bumper, right? I showed him pictures and everything. And the guy just answered, a oh, mechanic bumped into something with it. He tried to repair it. He put some welds, instead of uh, bending the bracket back, he freaking put some welds in it and he thought that this is fixed. Wow, man. This is, this is just stupid. This is plain stupid. I can't believe it. Check it out, man. Ah, oh, man. There you go. See what they did. They put new welds for no reason. Look at this guy. He freaking put new welds. Why? I don't know what to do now. Like, should I go back and uh, have him fix it up? I just don't have the time to waste tomorrow and go uh, deal with this stuff. I'm gonna try to just back up my truck and try to pull it out with the ratchet strap or something. I don't know. Something's gotta be done because this is this is not good. Leave a truck to get it serviced. They messed up your bumper, they didn't even tell you about it. They try to fix it somehow, and yeah, they don't even tell you. Oh. What is wrong with people, man? I don't like that shit. Tomorrow is a new day, today is not gonna happen. So, on that note, goodbye, see you next time.